today we are now going to discuss about the development of river network that we have studied the different types of river and its different landform has been developed due to the erosion or depositional activities of the river but before that we need to understand how this river network has been developed on earth environment basically when the rainfall occurs the rain water flows down the slope as a sheet wash after a certain period of time they forms the rills when the rills the neighboring rills are joined together they form the gullies and after the deepening of the at the down cutting of the slope and uh, with the river water they forms a rivulets after joining of these rivulets they form the river so there are certain phases they have followed for the development of a river in 1931 w s glock given explanation regarding the evolutionary phases of the drainage network development and according to him he is considered the homogeneous structure and humid environment and he followed that there is a systematic development of the drainage network which he has classified into the five important phases what are the five phases the first one he is known as the initiation initiation this is the phase where the skeletal of the drainage network is established like this type of skeletal is developed at the first stage and the second stage which is known as the elongation and in this stage the major streams elongated by the head water erosion in the newly developed slope that is in this way the stream are elongated and the third stage is the elaboration this is the stage that is characterized by the rapid multiplication of the small stream and the network of the streams are invades interprove and the drainage density is increases at this stage drainage density is increases then come into the maximum extension this is the phase where the maximum extension is occurred where most of the drainage system increase the number of tributaries and the sub tributaries the size is increases to maximum extent as it is the density of the drainage is increases at this stage and the last one is known as integration this is the final stage of the network development that 
the small tributaries are lost due to the stream piracy what is the stream piracy when the small river capture the capture by the large river stream piracy small river captured by the large river this is called stream piracy so does the number of small streams are decreases and the number of big stream increases and the size is also increase So this is the final stage. So these are the five stages that is introduced by W. S. Clock. There is a development of the drainage network and the evolutionary phases of the development of the drainage system. Thank you for watching this video.